Hello guys, uh, my name is Jawa Musul. Today we will discuss about the problem of the uh, first of all, I will tell you that the Alcohol comes up very easy to understand and to get the knowledge of how to do it and how to use the Alcohol comes up. So this is very easy to learn and understand. So first of all, uh, before moving towards uh, the First, we need to understand what is basically the algorithm means. By definition, if we see that algorithm is something that we can use to sort or order things, a computer program can be viewed as an algorithm in mathematics and computer science. The algorithm usually means a small procedure that is called a recurrent problem. Basically, uh, it's a definition. Uh, it's if you just try to understand what is algorithm, algorithm is basically a manner to sort things, to order things. Okay, uh, let me give an example that we normally use algorithm in computer science to make programs. For example, encryption is an algorithm. Encryption is an algorithm that transferring some sort of data or secure data from one secure place to another place. Similarly, for example, if we talk about Google, Google is also basically used the uh, algorithm to sort things to find the things on this computer. For example, if we go on Google and search something, for example, the best factors of Hollywood, for example. So, what happens is that on basis of keyword, the text is to enter, on basis of that, the Google search on web pages on YouTube and find all the relevant uh, material or data relevant to your text. Basically on basis of keywords it's search. So Google has some sort of very specific algorithm on that basically it uses to uh, on basis of the text which you have entered on Google it basically converts into the keywords and on basis of that keywords and the algorithm they the Google find in relevant websites and uh, materials relevant to your text. So algorithm is very uh, uh, very important. Let me tell you one another important comment is that algorithm is basically made by uh, Muslim scientists Muhammad Musa and Harden who are basically in Dada. So basically the algorithm is made by Muhammad Musa and Harden. I hope you understand what is algorithm? Algorithm is basically something that you can use to sort or order things. By definition, if you just want to give some definition, algorithm is something that you can use to sort or order things. This is the main definition. In, in computer science and in computer programs, we use uh, very much to uh, use algorithm to make different programs. So, algorithm is something that you can use to sort or order things. So now let's move towards our topic which is basically bubble sort. Bubble sort is basically an algorithm to sort things. Bubble sort by name is definitely noted bubble sort if we have the model in, uh, in a class so bubble will automatically comes on the upper side on the top side. So uh, bubble sort what is basically the bubble sort? Bubble sort you tell the computer to compare two items, the first is bigger and second is what they get swapped and so Double sort is basically a sorting algorithm which we use to sort things. The main concept of double sort is that we compare two items with each other. If the first item is bigger than the second, we swap. If not, then we do not swap the item. So this is called the double sort. So uh, now let's uh, move towards and see in a deeper sense that how we can use uh, bubble sort to sort things. For example, if you have a list of these five flowers, each flower has a different size. You can see from here, one flower is small, uh, one flower is big, and some are big and some are small. So there are five 
flower in the list. So we will see that how we can how we can uh, sort these flowers. This list. So first look at uh, look at the first two flowers A and B. A and B. If the first flower is bigger than the second, if A is bigger than the B, then swap it. Then swap it. If it's not, then save it. For example, here if we talk about A and B. A is this small flower and B is this bigger flower. A is smaller than B. A is bigger than B, then we will swap, otherwise not. So there we notice that A is smaller than B, so we will not, uh, we will not, we will not swap uh, the flower. Now move it to the next pair like B and C. B, uh, B and C, B is bigger than C, so we will swap. So C will come here and B is come here. We are comparing uh, B and C. B is bigger than C, so we will swap. So it means that this bigger flower will come here. Okay. Now we compare this this flower because it comes from here after swap. This flower is bigger than this, so we again swipe, so again it will come here. Now it will come here and swap. This flower will come here and it will come. Now we compare this bigger flower, this bigger flower with this one. Again we swipe because this this is the bigger flower it will come here. Swap it. You are getting a point? You are swapping. So uh, after that you will notice that the bigger flower will come here. After you have compared all the uh, pairs or the flowers in the right order, right pair, right order, you notice that after comparing this sort, you notice that all are in the right order. So if they are not in the right order, go back to the beginning and repeat. So we have to repeat the same principle again if they are not in the right order. Uh, let me try to again explain you. See, in the bubble sort, we always compare two items. If first item is bigger than the second, we will swap. Here you see that if we are comparing A and B, A is smaller A is not bigger than B, so we will not swap. Then move towards to the next bit. Then here in the B and C we compare B with C. B is bigger than C, so we will swap. Like swapping means C will come here and B will come here. Again we will compare this because it comes here now. Compare with this, this one will be bigger. Again swapping, then it will come here. Then we will compare this one with this. Again, it is bigger. So this will come here. This because it comes here, so it will come here. So this bigger flower will come in the last. If it the if it is not in the right order, like in the right sequence, so we will repeat the procedure again. Like we will do the first sort again. Uh, hope you find to got a point that we are comparing two items. At a time in the bubble sort, if first item is bigger, then the second one we will swap. Uh, if the first item is not bigger than the second item, we will not swap. Swapping is the main item. The bigger item will be swapped with the second. Okay. So this is the main approach or main logic. Comparing two items with each other. Uh, the First item is bigger than the second item is not. If it's not bigger, it is not shared. In, in this way, the, the biggest item will come on top of the top of the, the right side or on the top of it. If still the list is not uh, ordered or in the right order, we will do the bubble sort again. So we know that the bubble sort is very efficient. It is very inefficient because we have to do again in the game the sorting of bubble. It is very inefficient way to sort the game. Uh, I hope you uh, stand in the main concept of bubble sort. If you still have any query or question, please do ask me. Uh, in the last, I would say that I will give you. 
the uh, exercises we have to do. The first one is based on uh, the, all these exercises are based on exercises. We have to sort this list on based on size, like from small to bigger. We have to apply uh, the double sort on all these three exercises on the so there are three lists A, B, C. Uh, you have to uh, apply the double sort on all these three activities and all these three lists, and you have to sort it. Like the smallest one is on the left side, and the biggest one is on the right side. You have to apply the double sort. Let me give you just a Similarly, you can use the same logic here on the side on the basis of sizes. You can you can sequence all order. Similarly, here on the on this chart, you can use this other sort on the basis of size. You can you can compare or you can sequence or order this this. So that is basically a double sort. You are basically sequencing on the list on the basis of size, uh, which So this is the main approach of the job and I for this basically I will not have to talk about some things that you can use to sort the model. There are multiple uh multiple sorting approaches available, which is the conceptual sort and selection sort. We will discuss it later. Now we will not now we will keep it there uh, just in trouble sort. So thank you for your time and uh, if you have any questions.